Bye. Betty, I'll see you when I get back. Have a nice trip. See you soon. Have fun on the plane. Is Min going somewhere on an airplane? Yeah, they're flying to our grandma. It's her birthday, and they're going to her party. I wish I could go on a trip like that. My aunt travels a lot. She does? Where does she go? All over the world. Does she wow. bring any presents when she comes home? She sure does. I even made up a song about them. Really? Thank you for it. Okay, but will he help me do it? Sure, yeah. yeah. Let's go. I wonder what he Chokes around the world, dush. <laughs> yeah, you're just one of us to sing a silly song. Uh huh. But wasn't it fun? I wish Min were here. She loves seeing us look so goofy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's sing it with her when she gets back. Yeah. yeah. Min okay. is so lucky. She gets to fly in an airplane. Wouldn't it be neat if we could go somewhere every day after school? We don't, Michael. We go home. I don't mean that. I mean now, before we go home. Don't you wish we could go on a trip? Well, where do you want to go, Michael? Anywhere. There are so many neat kinds of transportation. Transportation? What's that? Tina and I learned it in class today. Transportation means a way to get from one place to another. Like a train. It can take you places. Wouldn't it be neat to ride on a train today? Or maybe sail in a boat. Or go real fast in the fire truck. Make lots of noise. I'd love to ride on a horse. Or what about an airplane? Yeah! yeah. 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 Attention all passengers. Attention all passengers. Please get ready for an airplane trip to Imagination City. Barney! Barney! Barney, I thought that sounded like you. Mm -hmm. You look like a real airline pilot, Barney. And we were just wishing we could go on an airplane right now. You can, Michael. You can use your imagination to pretend this playground is an airport. You're right, Barney. I'm starting to hear the planes right now. And there's one. There's another one. Mm -hmm. I see one, too. Hey, let's pretend that the stump is where you can buy the ticket. Okay, come on. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Here's your ticket. Your plane will be leaving soon. The man right over there will put your luggage onto the plane. Thank you, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. May I share your ticket, please? Taking one suitcase today? Yes. Now, if you have a seat right over there in the gate area, we'll call you when your plane is ready to leave. Thank you. You're welcome. Boy, oh boy, oh, another suitcase to put on the plane. <laughs> Your attention, please. This is the last call for flight number 12 to Imagination City. Will all passengers please get on board? <laughs> this is so much fun. <laughs> Fasten your seatbelts for takeoff. Here we go! <laughs> this is your captain speaking. We're flying high above the ground on our way to Imagination City. We invite you to look out the side of the plane. You'll notice we're flying so high that from here, people look as small as ants. Because they are ants, Barney. I mean, Captain. <laughs> hey, Kathy, pretend they're people who look small. Oh, yeah, those people 
do look really small. <laughs> Your flight attendant will be passing through the cabin to serve a snack. So, sit back and enjoy the flight. Care for some milk, ma'am? Yes, thank you. You're welcome. Would you like a snack, sir? Yes, I'm hungry. Would you like a magazine to read? No, thank you. Maybe later. Right now, I like looking out the window. Okay. Please buckle your seatbelts. We're about to land in Imagination City. Oh, here we go. On behalf of myself and your flight crew, I'd like to welcome you to Imagination City. We hope you enjoy your visit. Thank you. Oh, I like flying. <laughs> well, now that we're here, there are lots of ways we can go places. What would you like to do? Barney, could I ride a horse? Oh, sure you can, Kathy. Everybody hold hands and close your eyes real tight. And let's all say the magic words together. Shimbori, shimbora. Shimbori, shimbora. Oh, a surprise. I love surprising people. <laughs> Barney, this isn't a horse. Oh. It's a camel with five humps. That's right, Kathy. But we can ride camels, too. This is Sally. She's a very special camel. <laughs> Watch me and do what I do. Sally the camel has four humps. Sally the camel has four humps. Sally the camel has four humps. A ride, Sally, ride. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, Sally only has four humps now. I wonder if any more will disappear. Sally the camel has three humps. Sally the camel has three humps. Sally the camel has Three humps, so ride, Sally, ride, boom, 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 boom. Oh, gee, Sally, for a camel, you're a terrific dancer. Oh. Sally, the camel has two humps. Sally, the camel has two humps. Sally, the camel has two humps, so ride, Sally, ride, boom, 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 boom. Oh, oh, those humps are still disappearing one by one. Sally, the camel has... One hump, Sally the camel has one hump, Sally the camel has one hump, so ride, Sally, ride, boom, 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 boom. Oh, only one hump? <laughs> 
If she loses that last one, will she still be a camel? Oh, oh. Sally the camel has no humps. Sally the camel has no humps. Sally the camel has no humps. Cause Sally is a horse, of course. <laughs> you were right, Barney. <laughs> Sally was a special camel, but now she's a horse. Oh, I <laughs> thought you'd like her. <laughs> Come on, Sally, let's go for a ride. See ya, Bye, Sally. So long. Okay. You're a great dancer. Bye-bye. Right. 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 See you later. <laughs> this must be downtown Imagination City. <laughs> How can you tell? Easy. There's lots of big buildings. There's a post office and a fire station. And the police station. And there's the library. That's our school. We're pretending it's the library. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're right. And that must be the zoo. Mummy see, mummy do. <laughs> you do a great monkey, Michael. <laughs> hey, why don't we all take a bus ride around town? How, Barney? Yeah, I don't see a bus anywhere. Well, I just happen to be the Imagination City tour bus driver. <laughs> Oh, so let me show you around town. Come on, hop on the bus. Yeah, let's go. Oh, everybody take a seat. Are you ready? Let's go. Oh, I love sightseeing. Mountain, of course. But this looks like our playground slide, Barney. Ooh, not if you look at it through your imagination. You are on a special TCC mission. I'm here. And there's lots of woods and hiking trails down below. That's right. Why don't you ride down this waterfall and we'll all hike back to the city together. Oh, goody, we're going home. Oh, airplanes and horses and buses are fun, but sometimes it's nice just to walk someplace. You can look at things up close, like birds. And insects, you know, like bugs and stuff, and flowers. That's right. But before we start on our nature hike, what do we do first? We'll need to check our knapsacks. Knapsacks? Yeah, knapsacks. They're like backpacks for hikers. Oh. Now, let's make sure we've packed everything we'll need. Let's go. Come on. Good idea, Derek. It's always good to be prepared when you go hiking. <laughs> Oof, to keep my tummy full. Sweaters is that are made of wool. Socks to keep my tipsies warm. A jacket just in case it storms. Abandoned if I get an owie. Hawaiian shirt if we swim to Maui. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, it's just another one of Michael's jokes. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, it looks like we're ready to start a uh, hiking. We will go! <laughs> Barney. 
Born to run. Born to read. Born to me. My knapsack on my back. Hey, let's march. <laughs> I wave my hat to all I meet, and they wave back to me. And black birds call so loud and sweet from every greenwood tree. Michael, we can make an imaginary puffer belly right now. Puffer belly? What's that? Well, that's what we call old steam engine trains. <laughs> but how will we make one, Barney? Hmm, how could we? I'll be the headlight at the front of the engine. I'll be the smokestack. Oh. Oh. And we can be the wheel. Yeah. Oh, boy, then I'll be the engineer. Let's put our engine together. <laughs> Let's shine up the headlight. <laughs> and oil the wheels. I think we're ready to go now. All aboard. <laughs> okay, you can sing what I sing after I do. Here we go! <laughs> Oh, 
Imagination City Fire Department to the rescue! <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> I'm tired. And we didn't even have to put out a fire. But we did have to help somebody. And she was worth it. You were brave to help that kitty out of the tree, Michael. But please don't let her get stuck in a limb of our tree, or we'll have to do it all over again. <laughs> That's okay with me. I love riding in a fire truck. It was fun, but it's just about time to leave Imagination City. Let's see. We've been on airplanes and buses and trains and fire trucks. Can we sail back, Barney, please? Aye, aye, Captain Tina. You'd better climb up to the crow's nest to guide us home. Crow's nest? What does a bird's nest got to do with sailing? <laughs> oh, it's not a bird's nest. The crow's nest is the tallest spot on the ship. You can see the ocean all around. Then that's where I want to be. All hands on deck. Raise the anchor. Cast off the line. Make full sail. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, sailing we will go. Shiver me timbers. Oh. Raising the anchor, Captain. Casting off the line. Captain, raising the sails, Captain. Then off we go. Hurry up and jump aboard, Barney. We're pulling the work from the deck. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, boy. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. Careful, Barney. You're oh. rocking the boat. <laughs> Tell us a story about the sea, Tina. A sailor went to sea, 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 to see what she could see, sea, sea. But all that she could see, sea, sea, was the bottom of the deep. The evidence required. <laughs> and, um, I... What do I see under the ocean? Oh, there's a seahorse and a school of fish. Stiff breeze coming in. Oh. Sailing, sailing over the bounding main. For many a stormy wind shall blow before Barney comes home again. Everybody come sailing with me. Sailing, sailing over the bounding main. For many a stormy wind shall blow before Barney comes home again. Oh, holy ladies, launch the small boats. Let's row downstream! Oh. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 like this but a dream. Okay, come on, kids, join me! Is but a dream. Oh, all ashore that's going ashore. Oh. <laughs> Here we are, back at the school playground. I see Nana coming up the street to get me. And there's my dad, too. Hey, Barney, thanks for showing us how to go to lots of places. It's easy, Michael, when you use your imagination. I can't wait to tell Nana and Mommy all about transportation. <laughs> yeah, and it's fun to go places, and we love to travel with you, Barney. Oh. <laughs> we love you, Barney. Oh, shucks. And I love you. Let's all sing our song before you leave. <laughs> My favorite song. Great. 
big hug and a kiss from me to you. Won't you say you love me too? Bye, bye, bye. So long, kids. See you soon. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hello again to all my friends. I'm glad you came to play. Our fun and learning never ends. Here's what we did today. Isn't it fun to pretend? You can use your imagination to take you anywhere. You can fly an airplane, ride in a bus, drive a fire truck, or a train, or sail a boat. Trains, planes, fire trucks, and boats are kinds of transportation. Ways we get from one place to another. But wherever you are and wherever you go, remember, I love you. Stick around for more adventures with that cheeky koala, Blinky Bill, coming up after the... Followed at three by more crazy cartoons in Tic Tac Tunes. Time is back at the usual time, nine o'clock tomorrow and every weekday. Sh the chart shows a lot. What's in it for an M? Nor my aunt that occupies my thoughts as I prepare to leave. Evelyn's dream house. <laughs> well, this is your lucky day. How about this? Lots of room in the wardrobe. Plenty of storage space in the bedroom, and we'll even throw in the cat. <laughs> Now, how do you want it? Wrapped or as cards? Lucy Lockett and her fabulous dream home from Bluebird. Only one thing changes faster than fashion, and that's soap powders. They all talk about cleaning, but the age-old problem of washing without bleaching colours gets no better. Because, I'm told, these powders still heavily rely on bleach. But not a powder like Aerial Colour. They took out all the bleach and replaced it with colour-safe stain digesters. To prove it doesn't fade colours, I was asked to test it. After 20 washes with Aerial Colour, it still looked great, while with the other powder, the more it was washed, the more it faded. Fashions may change, but why should your colours? Ollie, get it on straight. You can trust Aerial Colour to do the washing without bleaching out the colours. The Fisher-Price Action Sounds Garage. The car will be over there at 2 o'clock. Where the two-way power wrench makes it so easy to get under the car, Change a tyre, customise, and run through the car wash. Can it come back up high? The Fisher-Price Action Sounds Garage, where the fun always takes longer than you think. World Cup cricket, there's a game of skill. It's about runs and tactics, not like this lot. Whoa! World Cup cricket, it's even better than real thing. Oh, baby born, please don't cry anymore. Baby Born has got so many new accessories. Beautiful dresses, special food, many marvellous meals and the new cosmetic set. With Baby Born, it's wonderful to be a mother. Zapf, the toys the children dream of. I couldn't believe these new thin nappies. They stretch and keep my daughter Rebecca really dry. These new Pampers Ultra Thin Stretch are fantastic. Before, with the children I've looked after, as they moved around, I've sometimes seen nappies start to gap and leak. Then you get a wet tummy. 
new Pampers Ultra Thin Stretch have a stretchy waistband and stretchy sides. They're designed to be better at gently hugging and moving with your baby to help prevent gaps and leaks. And with the new Ultra Core, they absorb so much better than before that they're the driest thin Pampers ever. These new stretchy Pampers are just such a snug fit. There's less gapping and great dryness. So now nothing stops Rebecca having fun. New Pampers Ultra Thin Stretch. The driest thin Pampers ever for drier, happier babies. My name's Coco, I'm a monkey like you. And here are... Sweet, Sweet, Peppy and Two. With finger puppets you can't find shops. You only get us free with Coco Pops. Oh, Put on yeah. your very own sooty and Coco show with three parents Coco Pops finger puppets. Why do you need special pack of Coco Pops? You are on a special TCC mission. An unpredictable cat is on the loose. He's wanted for offenses against a dog, an owner, and a kitten. He may be in disguise, or he may be in bed. If you see him, do not approach your television set. Sit still and observe his behavior carefully. He goes under the code name of Garfield and Friends. Best time to catch him, tomorrow at 7.25. Remember, TCC is relying on you, so stay tuned.